Hi there, Lynette Baker with Baker D. Young Realty Group, and I'm out here at our Carriage Avenue listing, 3328 North Carriage Avenue. This property is staged, and um, I think I mentioned that I was over here a few days ago, but I just wanna talk with you a little bit about why staging is so important. We stage almost every one of our properties, unless for some reason we can't, even lived in properties. We go in, work with the seller, bring in our own items, kind of mix in our own items with the seller's items. And sometimes we work with stagers to add some of their items as well. But when we have vacant homes, we hire a stager. We have two favorite stagers that we work with. You know, they have warehouses of stuff that fits different homes and different styles. So um, staging is just so important. Staging to me is gonna get you top dollar, possibly over asking. It's gonna get more people in there, into the home, whether it be an open house coming up or just general showings. Um, you're gonna get more people into the property. You're gonna get more interest for sure because people start online. And if the house is staged, it's gonna draw them in. And then once they're in, Seeing a staged home just helps give people a good idea of what they can do with their furniture, kind of the scale of the room. With a vacant homes, sometimes people will walk in and think it's a tiny home. Um, sometimes vacant homes, especially the bedrooms, they look really small. So just seeing furniture placed and ready to go and art and things set up a certain way, helps give people a good idea. So I hope that helps. I do wanna share with you some tips when staging. Let's just say you wanna organize your house, declutter your house, and start getting your house ready to sell. These are some of the things that stagers do. Okay, so let's start with a kitchen. Notice in staging, stagers use one or three items on a table and it just provides this unity and simplicity and notice the theme of one and three. This is an olive tree. Those are very in right now. It's good to put those in a corner or off to the side of a couch. See the rug for added texture and depth. See how the two opposite chairs on the sides allow for a little bit of a highlighted feature. See the single item on this table. So think of one and threes. Notice the three pillows, different textures, different heights. So usually you see on tables, see the three different heights, the taller vase, the medium sized vase, and the lower vase. Single work of art, another single item on this table, and notice the three items with the basket and the different textures here. So simplify and accentuate uh, some great pieces in your house and your home will pop. It will show really well and just see how everything looks uniform.